Hello, I'm Simon Mason and here's the latest highlights package in the Vitality Women's Premier Division. England women's teams were in South America facing Argentina in the FIH Pro League. At home, Inform Wimbledon hosted league leader Surbiton. This was the tight affair that we all expected, with the only goal coming from Steph Elliott in the 67th minute to give Surbiton the win. East Grinstead picked up a comfortable victory at home to Hampstead and Westminster, with footage from EG's YouTube channel. This is Barry from EG, they're um, passing the ball, keeping control of the game at the moment. Just taking their time, which is what they need to do. Pick the right moment to go forward and make sure that last pass is on the stick. There's a ball in the D by Lydia, great pick up by Sophie Bray, using a 3D skill there. That's and a goal by Sophie sure Bray, a great what goal. a goal. That all came from being patient build up, picking the right pass in the um, yeah, Sophie in the circle, you don't want to give her too many chances. She's not really doing anything at the moment. Again, easy, easily managed to play out and massive amounts of room behind um, Hampstead's midfield that Hannah Cousins is using her skill and speed to break. And playing for that ball to Rowan Bentley. Can easily take advantage of this here. What a goal there by Robin. What a goal. Great goal. Wait for the goal to go down and just lobbed it over her. So she just does things that there aren't as many anyone else in this country can do. Oh, and that's it. There we go. Person on the line, a straight strike from the second castle from Joe Westwood. Person on the line gets a good edge on it, but doesn't keep it out. The final match in the top six was Clifton Robinson's at home to Beeston. There were no goals in the opening quarter, but Clifton took control, taking a two-goal lead thanks to finishes from Catherine McCauley and Phoebe Richards. Keris Miller pulled a crucial goal back for the visitors just before half time. After the break though, Beeston came out firing. Lauren Borelli equalising almost immediately. Hannah Grieve getting what proved to be the winner six minutes later to complete the comeback. Surbiton remain top, a single point ahead of East Grinstead, with Hampstead and Westminster two points further back. With Buckingham competing in the Euro Hockey Indoor Club Trophy in Turkey, there was just the one match in the bottom five, but what a match it was. We'll join LSU TV for the action. Injection comes in. It's oh. hit by a stage and Holcomb with the goal. It's excellent to see from Holcomb there, just dispossessed at the last minute. Oh, now pressure, pressure from Holcomb oh, and it's gone. another goal. Tanya Escape with the steal from Lafra goes round the keeper and finishes with the reverse stick before being cut out again by Jen Park. Yeah, good pressure from Jen Park. Who goes there. back into the circle? It's lifted. Oh, it's a goal, goal for Lafra. Oh. Lafra bring one back. Ball stolen in the final third. Ball cr crossed in by Jen Park. Luffer ball in the middle. Pierce looking to go down the line. Park offering herself as an option, but it balls into the circle. But the 3D skills, Park with the shot! Oh, and put in at the back post! Goal. Ellie McKenzie with the final touch. It's now the injection from Holcomb Trap to a stage. Goes for the corner again, and she'll find it. Phoebe Martin unable to keep that one out, and that's Tanya Skates' hat-trick on the day. As we said, she's been so strong today, and matter of time until that was going to come. It was a well-worked routine from Holcomb, just giving it to their goal scorer, and she delivered. It might give some, Loughborough some momentum to get back on top. Great skill from Piscina right in front of us. 
Now it's Green out wide to Jones. And Holcomb looking for another one into the middle and they found it. Having just scored her third, Tony Escapes gets a fourth. Just turned over though. And now Holcomb have a ch an opportunity into the circle. It's a foot just outside. Now Holcomb, another ball into the circle, cut out by Mackenzie. It's the skate. She's got five. Yeah. And Holcomb with potentially the nail in the coffin. That win for Holcomb lifts them further away from the bottom, with Swansea and Buckingham, however, both looking in trouble at the foot of the table.